Howdy y'all, I'm Round the Wheel, you're watching Donkey Dong 94 and today the big man has decided to bring the action onto an airplane, which doesn't seem to me like the greatest tactical decision. Seems to me kind of like backing yourself into a corner a little bit. But who am I to judge? After all, I'm no expert in guerrilla tactics. <laughs> yes! Thank you, I'll be here all week. Be sure to tip your waitresses. Try the veal, it's the best in the city. This level has wind. Okay, is this a, yeah, I was gonna say, they shoot two at a time sometimes. Uh, but this level has wind. Speaking of wind, uh, nope, I'm gonna fall off. I thought I was gonna fall and lose my ducking position and put my face right on a bullet. Hey, hi. That was, oh, ooh, platform the MVP there. But yeah, that level has wind. And speaking of wind, I finally saved up the spoons to move my game playing device, the Dream Stream Machine from the office to the bedroom so that you will no longer hear wind tunnel noises in the background you're recording because my my uh my office is situated in such a way it's like right next to my porch and there we go all right and then pull this one up so we can make a big long floor and yeah so my office is right next to my porch and the way my porch is set up it creates kind of this wind tunnel effect when wind is blowing through and you can hear that in the background of some of my summer 2024 recordings. So thankfully, you'll never hear that again because I finally got into a place where you're not going to hear that. Okay, a lot of these are fake doors, but it's the one on the other side. I wasn't even paying attention when Pauline did the scream. That's how much I remember this game. That was pure muscle memory, knowing to go on the other side of the, of the, of the thwomp, I guess. I mean, it's sort of a thwomp. It's an eerie, faceless thwomp. Actual thwomps have personality, and their names are really cool. Uh, no, we want to bring you the other way, actually. There we go. All right. Just as long as one of them is stopped in a decent position, we'll be fine. Um, but yeah, we got to wait for this one to come back around. Yeah, thwomps are... What? I don't understand how that works. Thwomps have, thwomps have personality. Thwomps are cool. Thwomps have faces that go when they stomp. Oh, hey. I thought I was going to have to do a do a dance to that middle block there. Oh, no. Nutter butters. Okay. No, no, no. We can still pull this out. Yeah. <laughs> still salvaged it. That is pure skill right there, baby. 100% intentional recovery. Here we go. I think this is a bit of a windy spot. Oh yeah. Here we go. So we just gotta stay on here. Duck under the bullets. You don't want to get shot in the face. That's that's no way to save Pauline. Pauline doesn't need a man who's gonna get shot in the face. Pauline needs a man who can do backflips, who can somersault, who is totally ignoring everything Donkey Kong does. What is Donkey Kong doing with his Switch? Whatever he is doing has nothing to do with what I am doing right now. I am totally ignoring everything Donkey Kong does right here. Ah, right, here we go. New record. Not that it matters because we're up to 99 lives at this point. I wish the game went over 100 lives. But it's always satisfying to get to that point in a game where you are at 99 lives. You are completely safe. You are as far from a game over as East is from West. I like games that let you get to 99. Always very satisfying to reach that point. And speaking of reaching points, we have reached the halfway point of the airplane already. This one is a shorty. This one's a shorty for shorties. I have absolutely no idea what that means. And I have absolutely no idea what I was trying, trying to outrun that, uh, trying to outrun that bullet. I don't get shot in the face, but I do get shot in the butt. Shot in the butt, and I'm to blame. Donkey Kong's a great game. It's so great that I'm not even going to say that that was the game's fault that I got shot there. That was just me trying to sing songs and not paying attention to anything. There we go. Um, we don't need to use the rope. We can, uh, we can cheese this. We'll just do a... There we go. No, don't shoot me while I'm waiting for the ladder to retract. Hee <laughs> hee. All right. I'm having a little more trouble with this level than I should, but it's it's because I'm getting lazy. I'm being a little cocky. That's how I get with this game sometimes. Just the good times kick in, and there we go. All the way to the bottom. 
Gotta bring it to the bottom. Finally, inside the airplane a little bit. No wind in our faces. I think this next level is nothing but wind in your face, though, if I remember right. <laughs> yeah, I love this one. This one's a lot of fun. Because you get to do a, like, big crazy rope swing. Boy, I love looking outside and seeing a pink and green uh, cloud cover. That always tells me it's going to be a good weather day. All right, get going as hard as we can here. Uh, there we go. That's what we want. Big jumps. Big long... Oh, hey, we got a bonus game coming to us. Maybe we'll get a one-up out of it. Well, maybe. I say maybe. I could have guaranteed that we would get a one-up out of it, but... I had to go and play the slot machine, didn't I? Okay, well, let's see. Let's see if we can... Let's see how lucky we can get here. Let's go for question up. Come on. Okay, where where is Donkey Kong in the mix? He's somewhere around Mario? No, that, that's not it. Well, we will get at least one one-up, though. A Mario gets us a one-up. Mario is wearing some, some rose red lipstick in that slot machine shot. This level took me like three months to beat as a kid. This was before the age of FAQs and online walkthroughs and stuff. I got stuck on this level for a good three months. I'm about to beat it in less than a minute here. But, but yeah, back in the day, I just could not figure this out. And then one day, you know, you just had to sit with a game for a long time until, until the solution was finally manifested to you by angels on a beam of light. Nope, we don't want to bring it over just yet. We want to wait for it to drop. That's the genius bit. You wait, you bring it to the left, you pull the switch, you throw it on there, and then when it drops, bring it back. There we go. Roll it on back. We're rolling back prices at Walmart. Here we go. And, okay. Is this one coming at me? It's not. So we're going to go ahead and set up this ladder here. Come on down. Nope. Come this way, please. Thank you. Perfect. And you just bring it with you a long way. And I believe it's the highest up door. So, but we want to test that first. Okay, yeah, I just, I wasn't super confident in that one. And I also wasn't watching. I never watch where Pauline is screaming from. I mean, one of those doors is going to work, right? So, you may as well get on with your life. Airplane, here we go, here we go. Wind and barrels. That's not too bad a comment. Okay, sure. Just go right through my feet. You know what? That's a pro gamer strat right there. That's how that's how all the that's how all the pro gamers, that's how all the big boys do it. You know what? Here's one little trick. Here's one little trick that you probably never thought of. Try throwing the barrel the wrong way. Throw it completely away from Donkey Kong. Maybe with some luck it'll scream warp and hit him from the other side. Just complete swing and a miss. That's how all the professionals do it. We got our act together. It's all fine. So there we go. Airplane taken care of in short order. Not too long a one at all. And on our way we go. On our way to the iceberg. This is going to show us how fire melts ice. Mmm, fire indeed hot. I like the little I like the little runway coming from off the airplane. That's attention to detail right there. But yeah, the airplane, not too bad. Only eight levels. Pretty smooth. So now we're gonna move on. We're gonna move on to colder climbs. And we will see you all next time. For some icy, icy action. It's going to get icy and spicy up in here. <laughs>